Hey everyone, uh, so very short video about something that's been going on for a while now in Europe and that is the uh, persecution of the Roma people uh, you know they're often referred to as um, as what's what's the gypsies is the English term I believe um, so the traveling peoples of Europe um, they've been basically doing that for hundreds probably like a thousand years or more um, I'm not quite sure about the history there exactly um, but they get persecuted wherever they go and um, if we think back a little bit in the past the French were expelling massive amounts of Roma people and then uh, in England there was a community that was trying to kick Roma people out of their shanties and I think that's disgraceful and I mean this is that's not the only you know that's that's the discrimination they face in some of Central Europe but in other countries in Eastern Europe they get treated even worse they get I mean they get persecuted and seriously injured and killed um, and basically I mean they're they are a minority everywhere and not just a minority but a minority that is very visibly different and I mean so everyone knows all of the common kind of stereotypes and prejudices against gypsies they're thieving dirty whatever lazy um, the fact is they're a different culture they're very unique in Europe especially they're basically um, a lot of the time nomadic sometimes they settle somewhere for a while but they kind of consider themselves a people but they spread all over Europe and they live a completely different lifestyle the thing is this different lifestyle really does not place a major burden on anyone sure if they're living there and they're squatting there supposedly illegally um, because according to their own laws that's you know you just there's no one there they just live there I'm sure that creates some inconvenience and it doesn't fit into the way that we like to run our society um, but when you look at the cost when you look at the inconvenience it is in incredibly minor it is not an issue at all this is a tiny minority of people and it kind of reminds me of the big deal we make in Australia about the refugees that arrive by boats which is a couple of hundred every year it's a tiny minority it would be so easy to accommodate them to let them live the, their lives the way they want because that's how they choose to live their lives they don't want to settle down they don't want to move to a big city I mean some of them obviously do and that's that's their business but those people they don't so <laughs> they chose to do things their way um, and for that we pick on them they don't fit in so we have to we have to just get them in, to fit into our conception of what people should live like and we have to force our laws on them in every instance and make an example of them in some way and then in some more crude instances we can let our anger out on them when we attack them um, when you know people attack them and the police basically turns the other way because they're not voting no one cares about them I think it's a poor poor kind of it it debases society and it would be such a more wonderful thing if Europe especially considering I mean um, you know considering Europe's history which my my uh, my country of origin is <laughs> to a very large extent responsible for obviously um, but you know to just accept a minority that's not really doing any significant damage even though they're doing things differently and to let them coexist peacefully and not to try to force them into either adopting our exact way of life or getting the hell out you know no matter what the property laws say in that case that they're not going to cause the downfall of society
Um, and it would just be a beautiful thing. I don't know. I, th I think it would be a beautiful thing if we could once show that we actually have that tiny insignificant level of tolerance required to let people be that are such a small inconvenience but we don't and I mean I you know obviously I'm used to that we're all used to that right um, they're not following exactly what we want them to do they're violating our mm, property laws and our you know uh, regulations on whatever and so we have to crack down on them uh, anyways Church of SDF I'll see you guys all later uh, and I hope the Roma people um, get to stay somewhere and